Hi Gemini, welcome to your love reading Gemini. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. Let me just bring this table. Okay. So Gemini, this is a collective love message for your sign, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Please take what resonates and how it resonates for your situation. Okay, Gemini, let's see. Let's see. Let's see with whom we are connecting today for you. What is happening? What's going on? Important messages for Gemini, please. Gemini. Important, important messages for Gemini, please. A Kindle searching. Okay. Someone is looking for you, Gemini. Mm -hmm. Time apart. Okay. So we are connecting here with someone uh, with whom you might be with in a no contact situation. There is a time apart that your connection might be facing. I'm getting very strongly this is someone that you haven't been in touch for a long time, Gemini. You know, because it feels like this person is looking for you. They might be trying to find you on social media. They want to rekindle here connection, something, revisit the past, but I'm getting the strong energy of rekindle. So they want to rekindle this connection feelings that at the time both of you might share with each other. There is something here about the trust. Okay. I feel that this person um, maybe, you know, betrayed your trust at the time or there was something that to, something to do with the trust issues on their side. Confront. Yeah, this is someone who wants to talk. Mm -hmm. Who wants to talk about a specific situation that might at the time affected your connection with them. Okay. That's what I'm seeing here. Gemini. I'm not getting an en actually an energy of an ex. It's like you met someone, you know, something was looking, you know, there was a prospect of both of you, of, you know, there was a potential I'm getting. It might be a case that you went for a few days with this person, you know, you were dating them. But it's like it it at the moment you are not in 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 touch. Hmm. It's like something didn't fully manifest. This person here is looking for you. Mhm. Mm Show me more. Oh my gosh, we have a 10 of pentacles we ha and we have a 10 of cups. They want happily ever after and they want long long term relationship. My gosh. Show me more, please. Show me more with regards to this situation. Gemini. You might be dealing with a fire sign. Sagittarius. Leo Aries. How someone is really focusing. It's like they have a... They wish. It's like they're wishing here. If I have a star card, then they would be wishing up a star. <laughs> they will be... But I'm getting very strongly that they, 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 they do want to communicate. This is someone who is trying to manifest you with this Ace of Wands. That they are showing. I mean, that it's, it's shown here, sorry. On this card. This is someone who is thinking because King of Wands, yes, he's very passionate, he's very ambitious, he's very creative, but this is a passive energy. So this is, this is someone who's trying to manifest you by thinking about you. And they're trying to manifest happily ever after in a long-term relationship with you. This is someone who's dreaming to be in a relationship with you big time. What else we have for Gemini with regards to this connection, Six of Swords. At the moment, I, it might be a case that indeed this person is in a different country, different city or state. 
it's like there is a distance between the two of you <laughs> okay what else we have eight of cups and we have eight of pentacles it feels like this is very specific for some of you <laughs> these cards are showing me that um, something here had the potential to be very nice between you and this person but it like it never fully manifested you know this person hasn't forgotten about you if you haven't been in touch for a long time with them this person is thinking about you and they're kind of dreaming it is like what if what if you know we were giving more time something to do with time because what i'm seeing that the cause of this of this this kind of um a situation that this connection might be in and the, the 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 reason why it never really kind of manifests is that this person or you gemini at the time were kind of um um forced to in a bracket i mean forced to um disconnect or to move to another city or state because of work it might be your situation or it might be this person's situation because it feels we have two cards of uh of travel of walking away with regards to some sort of work related situation and it feels like it it didn't have a chance to fully manifest for both of you to be together because i'm getting one of you had to um move because that's where they they um or your 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 workplace was something like this i don't know but but it's just giving me this vibe that work here it's involved and it's like a major factor that that you know might have affected this connection at the time it like someone here walked away with a heavy heart mm -hmm. because and i feel this is this person here because we have this king of wands so and this king of wands he's walking away from from this 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 stability and it is something to do with their workplace maybe this person is traveling a lot for work or indeed they got um or office was moved somewhere else you know but i'm seeing here very strongly that it might be a case for for sure for someone either way you have here um gemini person who wants the ten of pentacles and the ten of cups with you <laughs> mm -hmm. we have a six of pentacles at the bottom of the deck this is someone who wants to give some sort of um attention this person is looking for you they are looking for you they want to give you attention they want to give you affection this is someone who wants to be very generous with their time this is someone who wants to come across as as a balanced and fair person yes and maybe that's why we have this confront card because something here needs um, some sort of explanation from their side they need to provide some sort of ex explanation let's see could you please show me this person's feelings towards Gemini? Five of Wands, haha, <laughs> two of Cups, mm -hmm. and the Tower. My gosh nine of swords this is someone who is losing sleep over this situation you might be dealing with aries i have also scorpio this is someone who's very conflicted it's like the inner conflict 
they are facing in their feelings here because uh, this is someone who is having a tower moment in their feelings there is this kind of enlightenment coming it's it's like a sudden understanding it might be a case you know gemini that um this is someone who is after uh, some sort of relationship right or love related situation and it didn't work out and i'm getting someone who is constantly um, thinking about you or trying to find someone who is uh, who has um, who is quite similar to you? I know it's it's it sound it might sound quite quite odd, but that's what I am getting. And this person is now like there is an enlightenment going on. You know, they are having the tower moment in their feelings because they are realizing suddenly they are realizing that you know no one here can replace you. It's like you are irreplaceable. Yes, is that right? You cannot be replaced. Okay. They love you. We have two of cups in their feelings. They love you. For some of you, it might be a case that, you know, um, this is someone who indeed feels that they owe you uh, some sort of explanation. And um, this is an inner conflict. They, they are fighting with their feelings. This is like, you know, having this inner battle with regards to feelings and this person here is realizing and i'm getting very strongly that we are dealing here with someone who's stressing out and who, who is not having a good time because uh, it's like this finally or suddenly realized that gemini is is the love of their life as uh, i'm being perfectly honest here the two two of cups and the tower in feelings it's like a sudden realization that this is the love of my life. This is the person that I want to share this cup of love. And it's like a whoa. Okay. Now I understand. That's why this person is dreaming to have 10 of pentacles and 10 of cups with you. But it's like they are looking for you. They're searching for you. Uh, I feel this person is constantly looking at social media and trying to find you. Maybe you've changed your name. Maybe you've changed your surname. Maybe you just have like a nickname, right? but they are stressing out. It, it gave me also a vibe here, Gemini, that this person might have some sort of regrets. Maybe regrets that, you know, they at the time they just walked away from this connection instead of fighting for this connection, you know? And it's like, they think, they, 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 they really don't, this is someone who doesn't have a good time. And I'm getting that this person is um, is worried, it's stressed. It's kind of haunted by this these feelings. It's like they might assume that they messed things up. And the thing is that they love you. They do. This is on what they're focusing on and this is in their feelings. Could you please show me how this person sees Gemini? How this person sees Gemini, please? I feel this is someone who regrets not putting enough um, care or they kind of, at the time, they uh, gave up on this connection. And I feel this is someone who is full of regret because they understand that they can't replace you, that, um, that you know, you are very unique. <laughs> For this person. Could you please show me how this person sees Gemini? Please. Let's see. Ace of Cups. Mm -hmm. The Emperor. The Moon. Indeed, you might be dealing with Aries. I also have Scorpio, Cancerian energy as well. This is, this person really wants to have, uh, wants to be given a chance to have this new beginning in love with you. 
we have a queen of wands at the bottom of the deck they find you incredibly attractive they see you as someone um, with whom they can have emotion uh, emotional fulfillment with the ace of cups who uh, this person I, i'm getting very strongly here gemini that this person sees you as a gift from the universe you know and they like they didn't appreciate it at the time or they didn't put enough work it's like they gave up that's what they're giving me with the emperor they seize you this is someone who puts you on a pedestal this is divine masculine energy male female please take it how it resonates but it's just an energy represented by this card but they seize you as someone um, as, as their divine counterpart someone who is very loyal very caring very stable and who means business also in control the moon this is the thing this person doesn't know what's going on in your life they don't know they don't know if you are in a relationship or if you're not in a relationship if you're single if you're not and they are trying to to find you and i'm getting very strongly the moon is this energy of internet if we have for instance ace of cups with the moon that represents you know like a communication uh through internet i mean this is just based on my personal experience aces with the moon it's like a communication through some sort of kind of form of internet yeah also page of swords with the moon can represent someone who is looking you know uh, to your social media who is looking at your social media that's the right way but they, they don't know what's going on they don't know they are in the dark here with the moon this is someone who is now overthinking over analyzing things but uh, they would love to have this new beginning in love with you So give, could you please give us the outcome? Will this person reach out? Will this person find Gemini? Could you please give us the outcome for the near future? We have a Knight of Cups, okay so this is nice mm -hmm. communication knight of cups is good news <laughs> so it seems that indeed there might be a case oh we have strength you might be dealing with leo we have chariot interesting this is a cancerian energy okay and we have this queen of wands at the bottom of the deck we have the world there is a distance between the two of you mm -hmm. i feel that at the time you closed a certain cycle with this person and they want to come back around here knight of cups it seems here gemini that this person indeed uh, will find a way to to find you and to communicate with you and we have a king of pen sorry king of wands and queen of wands this is someone who sees you as their soulmate mm -hmm. they person they divine counterpart with the strength and the chariot we have major arcana here big time yes this person is coming they are very excited this is someone who won't give up even if it takes like a you know <laughs> a few months in order to find you they will find you you have someone who is highly motivated very ambitious they want to be victorious they want to have a victory here and with the strength they feel this very strong connection with you like they, they share very strong bond with you because at the end this is someone who sees you as their divine counterpart the world you might be dealing here also with aquarius taurus scorpio leo we have quite strong leo we have cancerian energy we have aries very strong aries actually you have essentially here someone 
um, Gemini who who wants to rekindle something from the past but I'm not getting that this is your ex this is someone that you might have dated or you know that you might have been dating or you dated in the past but things didn't work out because uh, someone had to move or someone had to be somewhere else because of job or work situation or they were traveling that's why they were never present something like this and they are thinking about you they're trying to find you and i'm seeing here that this person is trying to find you on social media but um irrespective if you have social media or not this is someone who indeed it's coming here and you will receive a message from them because knight of cups bringing message he is a uh, he is a messenger that you know it's coming here with an offer of of affection love um, kindness and you have very good cards where you have strength and chariot so it will be something that will make you feel very happy and for some of you, you might feel well you know oh it was in the past with the world it's 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 old long story it's long gone it's it's done it's you know i closed the cycle you know because it really did it didn't really have a chance at the very beginning to kind of you know to to manifest into or to blossom into something really nice but a spirit is saying here that mm, this is someone who's coming back around and at and at and this time they want stable beautiful relationship because they see happily ever after with you Gemini so ex expect uh, that I feel that during you know this time during Christmas new or in, in at the beginning of January some someone here will 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 send you a message or will communicate there will be a conversation from someone uh, who wants to rekindle a romance with you I'm getting very strongly Gemini, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly appreciate you. Gemini, have a beautiful and absolutely gorgeous day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. Take care. Bye.